In line with the recently announced immediate, mid and long-term plans of the Nigerian Bar Association, Olumide Akpata, the NBA president on Wednesday, met with the Speaker of the House of Representatives, Femi Bajabiamila, to explore possible areas for collaboration between the NBA and the House of Representatives towards actualizing a holistic reform of the Nigeria police force through effective legislation. At the meeting, it was resolved that the NBA will collaborate with the House of Representatives. I can now speak to Caleb Adebayo, Associate Templars, to discuss this. Thanks for joining us, Caleb. Thank you very much for me. It's great to talk about this today. First things first, what's your take about the collaboration between the House of Representatives and the NBA? I think it's a beautiful one. Um, it's what we're looking forward to. So uh, um, like I, I, I said in other conversation um, with people, a lot of people are involved in this protest. Um, there are people who are on the front line and there are those who have to push uh, the policy with the policymakers, and that's what the MBA is doing, and it's doing a great work at it. It is important that we have long-term solutions. Um, the, the quick fixes can only work for a bit, but we need a long-term overhaul to actually make Nigeria work and the Nigerian police force work. So to this, to this extent, I believe that um, the collaboration is important, it is timely, and, and we, we hope indeed that it will be very effective. Now, it, it seems, yeah, that the NBA wants to work with the House of Reps, but what's the guarantee that these politicians will be on the same page with the lawyers? I mean, there are concerns that the politicians could feel that the responsibility is usurped. Okay, um, so w while this is a concern, and I, and I understand why it is, um, what we have seen in the past nine, ten days is proof that we don't need the politicians to accept um, um, our proposal uh, uh, in terms of we don't need them to accept that the NSAS movement is proper for the NSAS movement to continue. What we need them to do is come on board with the things we are putting forward to them. So, um, and, and it's something that everyone needs to work together for. So we need people who are in government um, to work with the people who are saying this is what we want to happen. Um, if you look at the protest, it's very organic in the sense that there's no one person that you would say this is the person leading the, the entire protest in Nigeria. And what this has shown is that the young people have individually decided that it's time to put all of this that has been happening to an end. And so there was no need for a political leader to say, oh, I'm the one anchoring this, I'm the one pushing this, like protests that we have seen in the past. And so um, them coming on board is only necessary for Nigeria to move forward at this point, because at this point it is a you are going to accept our proposal or we will keep protesting sort of thing. And it has gone beyond the shores of Nigeria because we're seeing protests happening internationally. So what the House of Reps and indeed every other politician should do at this point is not to think um, how would our responsibilities be shared if other players come into the mix? I mean, because of course, beyond the NBA, we're having other players, civil society saying, we want to come and sit down with, with the policy and lawmakers and bring lasting solutions to the Nigerian police force and lasting reforms. So this is not a, a superiority game. This is not a game of um, who is leading this, who's taking the glory for this. It, it's faceless. And the idea is that at the end of the day, we should have a reformed police force. We should have a reformed Nigeria. We should have a Nigeria that our young people and indeed our old people as well are able to say we are proud of. And so I, I don't think it's, it's a superiority context in any form. I think, I think it's something that everybody should put hands on deck to ensure that um, from whatever part you're working, you're ensuring that the goal of this is achieved. Mm. And uh, all right, as much as we would love to go on with this conversation, we'll fortunately have to say thank you very much for joining us at this time.